Hello friends, welcome back. Hearty welcome to you. In this session, let us try to find out the rank of word Janit as requested. Now we will try to solve this using regular method. After that, we will also solve it using shortcut method. Now we have to find out the rank of word Janit. First, we have to write them in alphabetical order. So let's go ahead and do that. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T. Then we have Z. Now we want to find out the position of the word Janit when we write the letters E, H, I, N, T, Z in alphabetical order and try to form the words. So to go to Janit starting with Z, we have to cross E, H, I, N, T all the words starting with this. So let us try to cross over them. So first we will write down all the words starting with E. Janit is a six letter word. So we need to take care of five slots here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 that means factorial 5 all words starting with E are factorial 5 then all words starting with H again is factorial 5 because 5 slots needs to be fixed then we have I same 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 factorial 5 then we have N let's go to N 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 that is again factorial 5 after that we have T 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 that is again factorial 5 now once we are done with T next Z comes so what we will do whenever we found a word we will strike it off and we will come back to the starting position so Z is there so I will strike it Z once I cross Z, that means I want to start with Z now. And then when I come back, I see E. I want E also. So E also is done. Again, I will come back to starting position. After ZE, I have H. So let us starting with ZE, H, how many I can get? I have to fill three slots. That means factorial three then let's go here after ze h what we have is ze i in the order again we have three slots that is factorial three after ze i we have ze n once we get n we will strike n we will come back again so we will have ze n starting with h so we have two slots to be filled that is factorial 2 now once we are done with Z, E, N and H after H is I when I go to I I will strike off I again I will come back then I will have Z, E, N, I, H only one is left out that is T that will be 1 and the next one is what we want Z, E, N, I T H one more so let's add all of them now factorial 5 how many we have 5 factorial 5's we have 5 times and we have 2 factorial 3's here and we have 1 factorial 2 and 2 1 so let's add them 5 into factorial 5 that is 5 into factorial 5 plus 2 into factorial 3 plus factorial 2 plus 2 5 into 120 600 plus 2 into factorial 3 2 6 are 12 plus 2 plus 2 so the rank of Janit is 616 now let us see how we can find out the rank of the word by using shortcut method in shortcut method first what we will do we will rank the alphabets according to their dictionary order we know first will come e we know this already a b c d e f g h 2 then i then n is i 3 then n is 4 then t is 5 and z is 6 once we rank them what we have to do now is we have to see 
how many alpha how many letters to the left of current letter are less than this so let us say if i am at z now z value is 6 how many are less than 6 1 2 3 4 5 so that means there are 5 of them let's go to e now how many are less than 1 nobody how many are less than 4 2 and 3 i see less than 4 i see 2 and 3 here so that means i have two of them so i can write down 2 for 3 there is only one that is 2 for 5 there is one that is 2 and this is 0 and with this step now we'll start from right hand side to left hand side put down 0 factorial 1 factorial 2 factorial 3 factorial 4 factorial and 5 factorial and multiply them so we'll be multiplying this and just add them and finally we have to add 1 at the end so let us simplify this calculation we have 5 into factorial 5 then 2 into factorial 3 plus 1 into 2 factorial plus 1 plus 1 which is equal to same if you are able to remember this is the same thing the last line is the same thing we got when we try to find out with the general method so 5 into 120 is 600 600 plus 2 into factorial 3 that is 12 plus 2 plus 1 plus 1 this one what we are going to add is after all the calculations we have to add one for the current word so total will be equal to 616 so this is how you can find out the rank of the word genith either by normal method or by the shortcut method